You can pick out a wrestler from like, oh yeah, a hundred yards away. Yep. Like, oh, you look like a bridge troll. All right, you wrestled <laughs> for your high school. <laughs> this is so weird. And they're always like, Ugh. they're always all like skinny, and I'm cutting weight for the. I'm like, good lord, man. What a life you live. Always wearing crew neck sweatshirts. Bro, you gotta, Every wrestler has just 14 crew neck sweatshirts that they roll through. Dude, you got to watch out, man. If you got any wrestlers listening to this, they take that shit personal. Bro, they have to know. They'll come. I mean, they'll come after What are they going to do? Come after Put me you. in a headlock? <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, dude. Just walking down the street one day, some guy just pins me. I I know a guy actually for a fact that probably would do that. He's that do crazy it. with it, dude. He's that. Just don't that rub wild. your weird ear on me. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Is that am I? Is this like do you think, was that like a strategy? They they just try to get the grossest cauliflower ear because they were like then at least you know half the field won't want to get near me. Why do they all have it? Don't you wear the things? I don't think a lot of them don't. Right. No, yeah, in practice, a lot of people don't wear headgear. Right, but you, you're, you're like you have to for meets and stuff. Meets, but in practice, it's <laughs> like, uh, and f- I'm trying to think of a, a parallel, like in football, just some shit. They're like, fuck that. <laughs> I just wouldn't want my ears to look that like that forever. Yeah, they just not like it because it's uncomfortable. Yeah, yeah. it's like it'll you'll get like rashes and stuff on your cheeks. So and instead stuff. of the rash, they opt for the. <laughs> Yeah. Fucked up ear. Well, it's usually you get that and Infantigo or something. So, yeah, oh, that's a, dude, that's a the thing other about half of wrestling. Yeah. How many rashes am I going to get this year? Just fucking roll. It's always the mat, too. Everything is so about the mat. You got to roll out the mat. I feel like it's half of the half the sport is the mat. <laughs> Man, those mats. Yeah, that shit was something. Bro. Oh, my God. And there's uh, how much did you want to just fucking like crawl like play jungle gym with those things though oh, when they be rolled around on that yeah. shit when i see a wrestling mat out i don't care what type of impetigo i'm about to get i just want to <laughs> <laughs> smack it 18 times and then run across it on my hands and knees <laughs> Do bear all the way to the other side <laughs> <laughs> fucking 30 years old i do that shit right now <laughs> just hands and knees bro oh shit <laughs> That's so funny, yeah, because, like, the dynamic between, you know, (laughs) you had the teammate who would play football and then would also wrestle, but then it was a very distinct line. Like, the wrestlers kind of didn't really fuck with the football players, and the football players also kind of didn't either because the wrestlers were like, (laughs) your shit's so tough, but you don't fucking do what we do. (laughs) And then you're like, bro, no one comes to your shit. No one cares. (laughs) No one goes to their shit. No girls wearing your jersey. Yo, yo, years. yo! The weirdest thing though was the was the wrestling cheerleaders. Yeah, I didn't want to say it. Can we throw up about that for a second? Didn't what wanna, was going on there? Didn't want to say it. <laughs> what? What? What's it for? What were they called? They had to. What were they called? Like Matt brats? Matt girls, yeah. <laughs> Matt Rats, dude. Or Matt Bratz. Matt Bratz. I think that I was... would quit on sight if there's a Matt Brat watching my <laughs> match. I'd be like, go home. But then <laughs> But then yeah, dude, like the the one girl that would like, you know, kind of maybe have some flings with a few of them. And not so like, Matt Brat should be a Matt Rat. Yeah. <laughs> a thing i don't know uh, nicola is that a thing i just kind of made that up well i mean in like middle school and stuff when i was wrestling that that wasn't a thing but i'm <laughs> I'm imagining in high school yeah that was probably i'm gonna throw up without calm you're talking about it right now this is matt bratting around dude <laughs> i'm gonna be a matt brat for halloween it was always the most unassuming girls that were doing that i'm like oh shit she's a matt brat could definitely kick your ass <laughs> Matt, wait, I'm trying to think of the other shit. Fucking Matt, Brad. You, you got some, can we get some, uh, sling, sling slots? <laughs> Shut up. Where did you, I didn't know about all these. I'm just messing, I'm just making them up off the top of the head, bro. <laughs> Risking Matt, goddamn, Nicola. <laughs> Good lord, bro. <laughs> Matt, Brad, what'd you say? Sling slut? <laughs> Cauliflower, cauliflower cats, <laughs> cauliflower kitties, bro. I'm about to throw up, <laughs> dude. What else? What else is some wrestling shit? 
Staff infection, sister. <laughs> Headgear hotties. <laughs> 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 Staff, <laughs> holy shit! Oh, oh, dude, you remember when Mrs. Mursa? <laughs> <laughs> oh shit! That's the mascot, <laughs> <laughs> dude. We're gonna be out at a bar and like just a fucking every put ex, me in a headlock, every dog. Ex wrestler is just gonna come up and beat the shit out of. I us. will bite their ear and dip <laughs> it in ranch first. 